Hi, I'm Adam Eda. I'm going to answer some of your questions today. Jake asks, best moment in your football career so far? Um, I would have to say the best moment in my career so far is probably making my debut for Ireland. Obviously, it's every kid's dream to, to play for your country and to, to put on the green jersey. It was um, a really proud moment for me, so I think that's got to be, to be up there. Adam asks, best player you've played against? I think this is quite tough. Played against quite a few players, but for me, the one that stood out the most was probably Tadic when we played Serbia, I think. Um, just the way he was able to keep the ball, his technical ability was, was a joke, so I think he's probably the best player I've played against so far. Josh asks, favourite beach in Norwich? <laughs> um, this is tough. Um, I've been to one, is it called Horsey? Horsey, I'm not too sure. Been, that was probably the best one I've been to, but I think that's the right name. Uh, Whitmore asks, which teammate do you have the best banter with? Um, to be fair, I get on with everyone in the group. They're all uh, top lads. Um, closest mates, probably John McCracken. He's, he's one of them. I was obviously in digs with him uh, coming through the academy. Um, last year, Billy Gilmore, Brandon, Andrew. Um, it's quite, quite a tough, tough question because I do get on with everyone. They're, they're a tough group. New York Canaries asks, what's the best advice you can give to young footballers? Uh, for me, the best advice to give would probably be um, just be confident when you're playing football and enjoy it. I think um, so many people are so hard on themselves playing football and it can be stressful at times, but I think uh, you have to overcome that and be confident in yourself. And like I said, in enjoy the game. You're playing with your friends. You're doing what you love as your job. So um, that's the best advice I can give. Tom Williams asks, what is your favourite song of the 21st century? My favourite song currently is probably, it's called Last Last by Burner Boy. That's probably my favourite right now, but I like, I like any type of music, so um, anything goes for me. Luke Harvey asks, what was your favourite moment watching Norwich growing up? Um, I think my favourite moment growing up would probably be, I think we was in the academy at the time and I think the Norwich beat Blackburn to get promoted and obviously being in the club at the time and seeing senior club get promoted back to the Premier League was, was a great feeling so that was the greatest moment for me. Uh, Josh asks, which player did you look up to when you were younger? Um, There's quite a few to be fair, I think when I was younger uh, I liked watching the likes of Thierry Henry, Ettore, Rolandinho, uh, Robbie Keane. Um, there was a lot of great players, but the, the one player that I look up to most was probably Thierry Henry. Matt Johnson asks, what is your favourite condiment? <laughs> I think my favourite condiment is probably ketchup. Nice and simple. Aaron Rodgers asks, favourite flavour Monster Munch? Um, <laughs> favourite flavour Monster Munch? I don't know what the flavour is, but whatever the original packet is, that's probably my favourite one. Jamie asks, which teammate has the best and worst music taste? The best taste is probably myself or Jordan Hugo. And the worst is... This is a tough one. The worst... Andrew. Yeah, he's got the worst, the worst piece. Duncan asks, what's your favourite ground to play other than Carroll Road? I think my favourite ground to play is probably Tottenham Stadium. Obviously, it's quite new and really modern and the pitch itself is, is amazing. So that's probably my favourite ground to play Paul asks, how much are you looking forward to getting back in front of the fans at Carroll Road? Um, yeah, I'm looking forward a lot. Obviously, it's, it's a great feeling to be playing in front of our, our own fans. Um, and I've been injured for quite a while now, so to get back out there is really exciting and I'm looking forward to it. Adrian asks, what does it feel like to score an important goal at home like you did against Everton? Um, yeah, it's, it's an amazing feeling. Obviously, it was my first goal at Carroll Road and 
just that excitement and, and so much uh, joy and I was so proud to, to get my first goal and it motivates me to, to want to score more goals in front of the home fans because that feeling you have is, is so amazing so yeah it's, it's a great feeling. Tom asks how is the pre-season camp helping the group build chemistry ahead of the new season? Yeah I think Pre-season camp helps a lot. Obviously, there's there sometimes can be new faces, so um, it's just like a team bonding session where you get to know new people and um, some of the lone lads will come back and just just to familiarise yourself with, with new people and even the lads that are here together build relationships even more and um, hopefully that can help on the pitch. Thank you for your questions. See you soon.